Hey, this is Eric, and I'm going to show you how tracking links work inside of Ticket Spice so you can track the different sources that are generating sales for your event. Tracking links also can be used with conditional logic actions to conditionally show or hide any option on your ticketing page and also automatically apply maybe a discount. So I'll show you how all that works in this guide. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is go under Promote, and we're going to go to Tracking Links. Now, we might wanna use tracking links to compare the sales sources from email to social media to the website. And so you can create a different tracking link for each one of these sources. So I might just do one called website and I'll just shorthand it with WB. And so hitting save will now generate a custom link I can now copy and I can have that be on my website. I also can do one maybe for social media. Maybe you can do Instagram, for example. So we can create one for Instagram, code IG, and add that one. And so maybe this is the one that is on the Instagram account. So you can continue to add these. Maybe it's Facebook, maybe it's email, you fill in the blanks. All these will now track that code through the ordering process. So then when you export your sales, you can compare where the sales came from. Now let's take it one step further. Let's maybe say we have a partnership with a radio program or an affiliate or an influencer. Let's add one for 93FM. And we'll use it a code 93FM and save that. Now I can give this to that radio show and they can put it on their banner and their link or their email and we can track sales there. But what if I want to automatically apply a discount when people go to 93FM's website? We can do that using actions. So let's compare here. We've got a $35 sample ticket price. We'll go under actions. We'll create a first action. And then left-hand side, we can do tracking link. And when the tracking link is 93FM, we're going to apply a 20% discount on that first ticket level. We can save. And then when we publish, that will now honor that tracking link. So if we go and grab that tracking link, 93FM, we view the regular link, we see $35, but if I now copy the link of the 93FM, see it's encoded up there, we now have an automatically discounted price, pretty cool. Let's say we want to expose a secret ticket level. Let's go to the page builder again, we'll hit edit, and I'm gonna add a new ticket level and we'll call it super secret VIP. And let's make this $100. You also can make it free, it could be free ticket level as well. So we'll add that there. So super secret VIP, and let's go under tracking links, let's add secret and save. And then let's go to actions and let's go when tracking link is secret, we are going to show the super secret ticket level. Now using that, that'll just show that ticket level as an option with the other ones. But what if I want that to be the only option you see? We can also use actions to not only show the super secret VIP ticket level, but we'll add another one to hide all the other ones. So let's then hide, take a level one and two. So we'll save that, we'll publish. I'll go and grab my super secret VIP link. We'll again compare. So by default, the super secret level's hidden because that tracking link is not valid. But then when I paste in that one, super secret, you view that and the only ticket level you see is super secret VIP. Pretty cool. So you can use tracking links a number of ways, again, to track sources, to track traffic, sales, any number of things. You can automatically apply discounts. In this example, you can conditionally show or hide various ticket levels as well. So that is the power of the tracking links. There'll be a lot more enhancements coming to them as we go over time, but they're live in your Ticket Spice account now. Can't wait to see you use them. Again, my name's Eric, and thanks for watching.